Hello everyone, welcome to Body and Brain Live class. This is Jung Shim. How are you today? Okay, so let's say hello to each other. Uh, Jurgita from Chicago, welcome. And Frances and Ron from New Jersey, thanks for joining. And Maria from Texas, hello. And oh, winter is back in Chicago, oh my god. <laughs> So need bright and warm energy to melt the snow. So let's send lots of um, um, solar energy to Chicago. Warm and bright energy to Chicago. Okay. Now Cassandra from Raleigh, North Carolina. Welcome. Thanks for joining. And Rand, get bright. Yes, smiles. I am an Earth citizen. Thank you. So um, today our main topic is stomach meridian. So did you bring your stomach today? Yes? Okay, how's your stomach? Good? Yes? So among the five elemental energy, like water, wood, fire, metal, and earth, in oriental medicine or energy philosophy, we uh, have five different energies, okay? And stomach energy is regarded as a center, the earth. Because stomach is at the center of your body, and also it connects our upper and lower body together. And the stomach function is very important in terms of not only digestion, but also overall stabilization of your energy, okay? So on Monday, we shared about the lungs, right? Lung, and Wednesday, we shared about the large intestines. Yes, great. So the lung meridian flows from your lungs to your shoulder, to your thumb. So that's how the energy flows from your lungs to your thumb. On both sides, from your lung to your thumb. And large intestine meridian is your index finger flowing from outside to your shoulder, down to your lung, and large intestines, your large intestines. And same way, from your index finger to your lungs and down to your large intestine. And today our main topic is stomach. So each meridian has their own particular time. So for example, lung meridian, 3 to 5 a.m. in the morning. So wake you up with a deep breathing. The lungs start to work. And between seven, uh, 5 and 7 a.m., the large intestine meridian is working, right? So usually your large intestine is moving. You want to go to the bathroom and empty yourself. And the next one is a stomach between 7 and 9 a.m. Your stomach meridian start to work. Energy is moving to your stomach. Then what do we usually do? Normally we have breakfast, right? Stomach. Okay, so stomach meridian starts from the bottom of your eyes, right below your eyes here. And coming down, please follow me without touching the side of your nose into your mouth. And from here, it goes into two different branches. One is going up to the side of your head. The other one coming down through your mouth to your throat, down to your collarbone. And from your collarbone, it opens a little bit and coming down to the nipples and going down and coming together around your stomach okay so it comes together at the third chakra area to your stomach and coming down to the abdomen from the lower abdomen it goes to the side to your hip joints going out and let me show you from your hip joint, it's moving out to the side, outside of your thighs, to your knee, outside of your knee. And here's the important point called Joksam knee. Here. And energy is moving down. And to your instep, to your second toe. Okay. So outside of your thigh, coming down 
to your instep right after your ankle go to your instep and to your second toe okay so this is a basic flow so today uh, let's send energy to our stomach together so first the bottom of your eyes energy starts from here coming down to the side of your nose to your mouth Though the energy is moving in two different directions, let's focus on the major one, okay? Going down to your throat, to your neck. Sending energy, yes, thank you. To your collarbone, open a little bit. And going down to the nipples. Coming down and coming back together to the third chakra area. Stomach. Sending energy to your stomach and coming down. To your lower abdomen and to where? Outside, to your hip joints. Outside to your hips. Sending energy to your hips and hip joints. And coming down to the outside of your thighs. And we're going to move our hands around the knees. Okay, outside of the knees here outside of the knees and you don't have to go down further if you unless you want to okay you don't have to you can send energy down to your legs outside of your legs all the way down to your ankles from your ankles to where instep instep energy is moving to your instep the top of your foot and going down all the way to the second toe okay that's where the stomach meridian flows okay so bring your hands together let's send energy to our stomach stomach is on your left side of your upper abdomen center to the left so you may see myself in an opposite way so please locate your left you know where, where is your left right left and right okay <laughs> so go to your a little bit left side of your upper abdomen and gently rub that's where your stomach is. Stomach and sending energy, warm energy to your stomach. Okay, Harshikani, welcome. And Arlington, welcome. And Rudanim, and yes, from Miami. Oh, Margina. Okay, Argina. Okay. <laughs> so keep sending energy to your stomach. Now, Feel the energy in your hands. Open and close. Imagine your stomach. The condition of your stomach. Now let's send energy to our stomach. Starting point. Okay. Very good. To your eyes, right bottom of your eyes. Sending energy to your eyes, to the side of your nose. Energy is flowing down into your mouth. Into your mouth, yes. And down to your neck. You can lift your chin up a little bit. Sending energy to your neck. And round your collarbone, going out, expand, and down to the center of your chest, around the nipples, sending energy to your chest, and coming down, and it's moving to the center, towards the center, to your stomach, and stay there for a minute. Keep sending energy to your stomach, focus on your stomach. Take a deep breath in and breathe out. Again, sending pure, bright energy to your stomach. Imagine your stomach is getting healthier, brighter and stronger and breathe out. Very good. Energy is continuously moving down to the lower abdomen. And from the lower abdomen is going out to the side. Sending energy to your hip joints, hip joints. The stomach 
is related to your joints too, to your hip joints and going down to the side of your legs, outside of your thighs. Energy is coming down to your knees. Let's focus on your knees. Now when someone has a problem in their stomach energy, in energy in the stomach, their knees also have some trouble there, okay? So by healing the energy in the stomach, you can improve your knees condition, knee joints. Sending energy to your knees, knees. Your knees getting warmer and pure bright energy is flowing into your knees. Now with the power of your mind, you can stay your hands there. Energy is moving down to the eye star outside of your calves. Going down all the way down to the ankles. Focus on your ankles. Energy in your ankles. And flowing down to your instep. Focus on your instep. And energy is flowing all the way down to your second toe. Feel your second toe. Now with the power of your mind, draw the line from the bottom of your eyes. Energy is flowing down from your eyes, down to the side of your nose, into your mouth, to your throat, the front side of your throat, front of it, down to your collarbone, to your nipples, to the center of the stomach, coming down to the lower abdomen, flowing out to the outside of your hip joints, flowing down through the outside of your thighs, to the knees, outside of your calves, ankles, to your instep and to your second toe. Great job. Now bring your hands together again. Bring your hands in front of your stomach without touching this time. Now send energy with a gentle motion with a circle. Focus on your stomach. Now close your eyes. Imagine pure, bright, brilliant energy, life particles flowing into your stomach. Your stomach is getting healthier, brighter and stronger. The energy is becoming healed and strengthened in your stomach. And feel the movement and vibration of energy in your stomach. Our internal organs are all connected to each other, supporting each other. Stomach is not only in your abdomen, but its energy is connected and spreading throughout your whole body. So I want you to have more holistic and comprehensive point of view of yourself, more than your physical body, Now, very good. Now, bring your palms together again. Feel the energy. Let's go up to the eyes. Sending energy to your eyes, right bottom of your eye. Flowing down to the side of your nose. Energy is flowing into your mouth and one branch is moving up to your head and follow the another branch down to your throat. Energy is flowing down to your neck, the front of your throat, down to your collarbone, down to the nipples, And it's coming together at the upper abdomen, your solar plexus area, down to the stomach. Energies keep moving down to your lower abdomen. And open to the side, to your hip joints. 
go to your hip joints about two to three inches apart and send the energy to your hip joints. Focus on your hip joints and energy is moving down to the side. Your hands around to the knees, outside of your knees and stay there. Energy is continuously moving down to the outside of your calves all the way down to the ankles and instep focus on your instep and all the way down to your second toe very good now your stomach energy meridian is activated and energy is flowing naturally now please bring your hands together and to your stomach again sending energy one more minute close your eyes breathe in deeply and breathe out please deeply appreciate your body your stomach there's energy there's information there you can heal those energy through the life particles. Thank you. I love you. Thank you. I love you. Thank you. I love you. Okay, everybody, now open your eyes, take a deep breath, and exhale. Again, breathe in, and breathe out. One more time, breathe in deeply, and breathe out. Okay, open your eyes. Great. How do you feel now? You feel more relaxed and calm? Actually, our stomach is highly related to our stress, sensitive to our stress, and directly connected to our brain also. So if you heal your energy in your stomach and circulate the energy there, you can release your stress more easily. Also, you can activate your energy flow. So would you share what you felt and experienced uh, in the chat room? Let's have some sharing time. How was your experience? Okay. And William, uh, stomach, my favorite point. Okay, stomach 36. Yes. Okay, great. And Dina from Atlanta, welcome. And Sonika Lee from Chicago, welcome. Thanks for joining. And Aurora Castillo, from San Diego. Oh, great. Feeling more recentered. Thank you. Yes, stomach energy has a tendency to bring you the center. Strong foundation and calmness that comes from your stomach too. Yes. So please keep focusing on your body, uh, especially during the day from time to time, the energy feeling and energy circulation. Okay. And you may notice that, you know, when you are sending energy to your knees, um, the knees can vibrate. And these days, um, there are so many tension and stiffness in our knees, right? So it can help you increase your knees, yes. And Cassandra, you feel calmer. Okay, great. So, hello everyone from London. Wow, thank you for joining from London, yes. Sending light particles to London too, okay? And Ron feels like it helped my stomach, large intestines and the lungs. Yes, so those are how the energy flows from your lungs, large intestines and to your stomach. So as we go through every day, step by step, let's activate our energy channels. And Jurgita, thank you, feel more calm, yes. And Ruta felt very strong energy. Thank you. And Harshika Nim, yes, I feel relaxed and calm. Thank you so much. 
Okay, so your health and well-being is very important because each and every one of us, we are part of the earth and humanity. So let's keep taking good care of ourselves. Adriana from Las Vegas. Yay. Okay, thanks for joining. And Maria, uh, what an amazing thing is to feel energy, energy and heal myself. Yes, thank you. And Frances, feel, feeling much better all over. Yes, thank you. And Adriana, uh, feel relaxed and help my knees. Yes. So again, our whole bodies are interconnected. I still feel heat. That's great. Yes, that's a healing temperature. So um, though we are going through some challenging times all together, let's keep making ourselves get bright. Okay. And once again, um, April 22nd uh, is an Earth Day. We're going to hold an International Meditation Day event for the Earth Day to send energy and light particles to all of humanity and the Earth together. So let's keep joining and moving together. And Yugi, aloha from New York City. Oh, thanks for the great Qigong session. As the second chakra point, same as the Dantian. Yes, Dantian, Danjeon is the same point, the second chakra. Okay. All right, everybody. So let's keep getting bright and keep being connected. And also we have another live class at 8 p.m. Eastern time. So thank you so much for joining. Uh, please um, uh, remember to like, uh, comment, and share with your friends and families. And let's be healthy and well together. Okay, 감사합니다. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Sending light particles to all of you. Thank you.